Okay, so here's the two capacitor sets, and I think I've got them lined up the way the paperwork is saying. Here's the long piece, which is the C4, which looks quite a bit different than the other set that has no long one, and it has a nice little recognizable coil spot called C1. So I'm looking at this being the C1, the little coil there. So I'm just going to kind of show around here so I can get a visual on what's what. It looks like on both of these, um, I'm seeing the pins on the right side. So if you kind of pull that out, you can tell that those are the pins going into the capacitor. You pull all four of those out on this right side would be the pins. Same with this one, pull those out on the right side, and all of those would be the pin side of the capacitor. Put those back in for a moment. And it shows putting C4 into C1. And so that would be this long guy into this little coil here. So it looks like they lay in the container this way, so I'm going to go ahead and turn them over. And then see what I use with my hand. That goes in there. So that's my start of where it looks like they go in, in this little canister. Right, so I'm going to leave them laying the same way. That one there it kind of clips into these little clips. This one is still laying on its side the way I had it. And it clips in there. And then this longer one will go into this little receiver here. You can do that when I'm not videoing. Okay, so completing this part, the what ends up being the lower two wires. So this is C3 
going to B2 right here. And then this is C2, it's right there, going to A1. We got those two. And I step to this other side. I'm just going to show where it comes out of. It comes out of that lower pin. C5 to B7. There's the little tree there that shows what belongs where. And then C6 that comes out of the, the bottom, the far bottom pester there. And then goes into, follow this, A8. a little bit of a trick with these wires. You grab your pliers and every time something moves you rearrange it and put it back together. And apparently just one wire fits in each side of this little electrical thing so you kind of just have to make the wire go about halfway through, not all the way through. Yeah. Mm -hmm. 